Look who it is! It's Joe Franz! Hey, it's me, Joe Franz. And behind the camera, of course, is Sean and MJ. And it's a bit windy, so let's hope there's not... Uh, oh, uh, bad sound, bad sound, bad sound. I mean, did, did you see Viva La Bam? Yes. It was all bad sound, because it was reality television. What they're now calling a scripted reality. Now, <laughs> now that the fans are realizing exactly how we did it. It was scripted! It was scripted! You can tell it was scripted! That's what they're all <laughs> saying now. The kids learned a new vocabulary. It's like, like word of the day, um, scripted. Last week's word was Ming Hags. Yeah, thank you. Wait, last week's word? Last Every week's word is Ming Hags. Yes. My... Hey, no. Thank you, thank you. And I'm excited because we're here in Towson, Maryland, and for the first time in like 20 years, I've found my favorite childhood snack, corn nuts, and they haven't changed the, the ingredients one iota. It is still awesome. But not as good as as uh, ze zesty salsa the combos. combos. You, you just united with your favorite childhood snack. Yeah. I did that with one of mine a few weeks ago. Dunkaroos. D what is a dunkaroo? Dunkaroos. It's like this little Australian cook. You know, it's like a packet with little cookies, and then you're supposed to dump them in icing. I just steal the cookies and then put. There's a the kangaroo on the front. And then, like eat it in one. Whenever I get a cake. I don't really eat the crumbs, I just eat all the icing and that's it. You probably, you know, if there's icing left over in the fridge, you probably eat the icing before you eat the cake. Yeah, sometimes I don't even eat the cake. Well, all this food talk is making me thirsty for beer, and we're in front of a bar, so let's go. Yeah, Glory Hole. Is that what it's called, the Glory Hole? No, it's called Glory Days. <laughs> Sounds like a gay bar, the Glory Hole. Yeah. The Glory Hole. Oh, yeah. And we yeah. live our Glory Days. Yeah. So, okay, let's do it. Oh, wait, um, yeah. I wanted to ask you. Now, isn't the Bloodhound Gang out tonight? Yeah, that's why I'm here, to go to the Bloodhound Gang concert. You think you could get us into it? What are you going to do for me? I don't know, but I mean, you you know them. You've done their videos. Don't you think you could get us like into the show? I can get you in, but what are you going to do for me? Whatever you what want. Else, right? Do we have, always have to do something in return? Yes! <laughs> we'll talk about it. Here we are outside of the Bloodhound Gang concert, Franz. It's freezing, and I told you guys I'd get you in. I wouldn't lie, but you owe me one. Yeah, we owe you. Okay, well now, you tried to get money out of the uh, Mac machine, which you can never get money out of the money well, access my, machine. My debit Why? card is dented for some reason. You've scratched it. There's like I, a suit on purpose. His debit card gets dented every time it's time. Every Fine. time. Excuse me. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, every time it's time for him to, to pay back the money he owes me from the town from the uh, the Maryland State Fair, suddenly his money access <laughs> card is dented. But it's all right because we will we're gonna work it out. Yeah, like maybe I could I don't know um, make you a Pepsi float or something. What? I don't know, you know, root beer float looks like a Pepsi, okay, a Coke float's better. Something, some kind of dessert treat, something wrong. A Jägermeister float? To pay you back. We're gonna work it out. Yeah. So, we're gonna get in there, right? I hope so. Okay. We're lucky. Let's hope. Hey, Joe. Okay, so here we are. We're in the, we're in the backstage of the Wrecker in Townsend, and here... We have J.J. Sinatra, the hey. J.J. Sinatra. How you doing? I just made his new video. It's not been released yet. It's uh, it's mid-February 2009. It's going to come out in you know, two weeks. And uh, I was very excited to work with you. Of course, he's trying to save his voice, so I'm going to yeah. talk for him. Yo, I'm J.J. Sinatra. What's up, man? What's up? Check out my... Dude, it was so awesome to work with you. You are oh, one man. talented... Well, same, same, you know, definitely, you know, I don't know what the f*** to say, man. I blew my throat out you know, at the, the Million Club, you know, I gotta go on in an hour, so what you gonna do? But, uh, Don and Murphy, sh that's what's up, man, thank you for having me on, my man Franz, you over here. Thank you for being on. Same. It was a pleasure having you, sir. Oh, thank you so much. You look like a young Howard Stern, almost. <laughs> Without the cleft, though. You need the little cleft. Nah, I'm playing with you. Anyway, salute. JJ Sinatra, ladies and gentlemen. How you doing? Jeez, I'm just looking at all this food. I'm right? starving. I've not eaten since, like, breakfast today. Hey, uh, guys. Uh, just so you know, this buffet mm -hmm. is uh, reserved for the bands who are playing tonight, uh, of which you are not a part. And, uh, just... This is like the faux pas. This is like the faux pas of of being backstage is eating the band's buffet food. It like it's pretty kind of not cool uh, what you're doing, and you're still doing it. 
and everyone's here. Jimmy! Joe, what's going on over here? Uh, I brought my, uh, my, my buddy Sean and MJ, uh, and they are embarrassing me by eating your food. Yeah, I was just thinking, why the f are ugly girls eating my food backstage? Because these are the ugliest girls I've ever seen backstage. These are actually dudes. Oh, oh dudes. Oh. What's yeah. up? Hey. Uh, here, here, here's, 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 here's the deal. I, I promised I could get these guys backstage if they did me a favor. I haven't figured out what the favor is. Maybe you could help me figure it out. I don't know. I think the favor should be they should help you so you don't dress like you're from Seattle in 1991 anymore. <laughs> That's nothing wrong with that. That's an awesome True. look. It is. It's a strong look. A lumberjack look. You and I are picking up later. That's, that's what's going to go down, and you know it. I mean, whether you're a chick or not. Because you know? obviously, if he's a dude, he's a <laughs> You know, a lot of people online do say he's a closet homosexual. Really? And I always really? kind of figured... I got a closet. Would you like a piece of cheese? <laughs> I'm dry. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna cut this, guys. You've embarrassed me enough. So, guys, how you doing? Good. I mean, uh, just hanging out. Getting a little problems. close out here. So, yeah, I mean, usually by this time of night, we're 69 in each other. Yeah, this is cool. I mean, if it was to drink, that's all bad. makes it easier. Can do what I want. If it's free, I drink. All I know is now, and it's bumpy. I told you I'd get you backstage. Yeah. You told me you'd return the favor. You owe me one. Of course. Yeah. I'll do it. I'll what are you going to do, though? Yeah, what are you going to do? Jimmy, you tell him what he's going to do for me. Because you're the smart What's he going to do? He's the brains of the organization. Do you know? He's I, the brains I, of the organization. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> do they have any ideas? Uh, I think they would agree, if, if you didn't notice. Uh, but anybody that uh, shows up to a, a club that the dug Joey Ramone's jacket up from the grave to show up. The guy obviously needs to get some tail, some some uh, lady parts. Um, so I think you should get him laid. Because you have gotten backstage, you're hanging out with uh, a pretty crummy band. But the fruit, there's food, there's shit to it's, do. It's really good. There's, there's a really good garlic potatoes out there. Yeah, well, I mean, the, you know, that was the highlight. Yeah, there was good stuff. <laughs> I love that. The greatest highlight of your show is rosemary potatoes. It is. So I'm just saying, I don't I love the jalapenos. And there's some kind of a unique beer in there. I don't even know what it is. We're losing the thread of it, which yeah. is that Jimmy Pop told me to tell you, you're going to get me laid by the end of the night. With a chick. That's, that's always, <laughs> that's always, you got to always got to okay, say that. Okay, I'm kind of swimming in new waters because when it comes to getting laid, I'm really good at getting myself laid, but I haven't done it too often for the people, but I will definitely give it my best try. You got to try it with a partner. The game is on. The game is on. Ladies and gentlemen, you're not going to be able to see this because we're not supposed to be filming right now, but J.J. Sinatra, the legendary J.J. Sinatra, oh green eyes, oh green eyes, baby, is about to go on. That's right. Okay, so it's proper etiquette, as we've learned, to not touch the band's food, yet we're wasting no one has touched this. I know. This is picture perfect. This is Martha Stewart time. No one has touched this. 
Nobody here likes a salad. No one. Look, look at this. Th this could have easily been a mixed salad, yet each individual cucumber and tomato were alternately sliced together. It took probably three hours on the presentation of this, but it could have easily been a mixed salad because no one cares. It's salad. This is backstage of a <laughs> rock concert. I don't know. I want roast beef and Thank you. <laughs> okay. Here we are. The Bloodhound Gang is going on in 10 minutes. And despite MJ's valiant efforts, I so didn't get laid. However, the night is young. And I just want to say that in all of the Bloodhound Gang's performances, Novak almost always shows up. Like, they'll play in Canada, they'll play in Europe. Novak will be there. However, we're in Towson, Maryland, Novak's hometown. He lives three minutes away, and because this is where drugs are um, easily available, shall we say, Novak isn't here. And you'll notice on the set list is Novak's introduction, which <laughs> ain't gonna happen because Heroin is so prevalent in this neighborhood that he couldn't resist. Jimmy, what are we going to do? Uh, we're probably going to cut Novak's introduction. Right. And maybe a couple of the dumb songs, though. Okay. All, all, the, all the garbage will get cut out. Um, it's always a shame about Novak, you know? Yeah. Well, other Can than... Do we have Novak? Yeah, Novak. Uh, Wait, other than... You changing my whole look, is there anything you can do about me getting laid, possibly? Um, I, I, I mean, I guess once we find Novak, we'll close the deal for you. Okay. Yeah. Fair enough. Well, he's into it. Well, well thanks Thank again for having us back uh, backstage and having Thank us do your show. Thank you, fellas. Show. Let's bring some rock, shall we? Yeah. Party. Party on, dudes. <laughs> Big up. <laughs>